I feel It's a new dawn It's a new day It's a new life For me And I'm feeling Running free, you know how I feel. Blossom on the tree, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. And I'm feeling good. Dragonfly out in the sun, you know. Butterflies all having fun, you know what I mean. Sleep in peace when day is done, that's what I mean. And this old world is a new world and a bold world for me. Steph, there you were, opening the show, a big, full-on production number. How big a challenge was that? That was a massive challenge, actually. You'd think the big lifts were the big issue, but it was really stepping on the boys' backs. I was terrified of hurting <laughs> them. In the rehearsals, all you could hear was, oh, ow! Oh. <laughs> but then they weren't wearing mics, otherwise I'd been in trouble. <laughs> and Jenny, it is Big Band Week. Uh, what sort of extra pressure does that bring? It is a lot of added pressure because the band is so big, you know, you want to kind of match it. But the minute, you know, the band starts going, it's just, I can feel my heart beating. It's brilliant. I love it so much. All right, well, given the week that's in it, let's have a, a big hand for the big band and Nigel Wright. <laughs> Terrific. OK, time to head over to the panel for some comments. Uh, John, how, how did they fare tonight? Well, what a cracking opening to the show tonight. Yeah! Ladies, quarterfinals is fastly approaching and each performance has to be bigger and better than the last. Steph, you sang about diamonds being a girl's best friend, but after that performance, I think the Scarecrow and the Tin Man are going to be your new BF. <laughs> you had choreography in that performance, you had props, you had boy dancers, and you handled it effortlessly. You made it look easy, and that is what a leading lady has to do. Jenny, I don't know what those girls did to you down at Mamma Mia, but you got your mojo back. <laughs> You were feeling good, and I was feeling good. You really grew throughout the performance, and by the time it came to the end, you really packed some punch. I thought it was great. Right. I'm thinking John liked it. Yeah. Uh, Sheila, were you impressed? Well, you know, it's really fascinating. When I started this, I thought, I can't imagine anybody but Julie Garland, I'll be honest, because I saw her when I was a little girl in the film, and it was such an iconic performance. But now, the two of you, I mean, it would be wonderful to have a mixed-race girl as the orphan from Canada. <laughs> It would be equally wonderful to have a lovely blonde girl. It really doesn't matter. I thought you could have used the lyrics a bit more, Jenny. That for once, you haven't got vacuous pop song lyrics. You've got beautiful lyrics, and you could have coloured it a little bit more. Steph, I thought you were terrific. I thought you could have gone a little bit further for you. There's more in, in, there, in there than I actually saw, but you were both terrific. Uh, Charlotte. Oh, 
Oh, Steph, you are a diminutive diva. You were just absolutely brilliant. Blew me away again. It was coquettish and flirtatious, and your vocal was spotless. Really, really great. Well done. And Jenny, you pull it out of the bag. When the pressure's really on, you always just perform. So, I mean, the vocal was really, really great. You actually, in some parts, you sounded like a different singer to last week, and you just owned it, especially towards the end. You absolutely owned it. Well done to the both of you. All right, top marks from the panel. How's the Lauren feeling? Andrew? Well, uh, the, the first thing, of course, is about the lyrics, which is, which is really interesting, because when you've got a big band number and you've got choreography, being able to master the lyrics is not necessarily that easy. And, Steph, of course, you had a Julie Stein song. And, by the way, congratulations on the way you saved our show last week with the beginning of Oklahoma, when she heard that the band had come in a little early. And uh, we won't go into that, but you saved the day. You know? But it, it's a really difficult, difficult thing to do choreography and lyrics and really get the, uh, get the whole thing understood you know because it, and that's of course the problem Jenny because in one sense that song's music plays rather against the lyrics and so your job as an actress is to try and somehow get over the scent of the pine and all the wonderment against what in fact is a kind of big bump and grind number uh, you did very well but that's a difficult job for an actress to do